This is the Haynes NASA Space Shuttle book. Um, found this book inside in a kind of a book supermarket. Um, nine euros, which was nothing really. Um, it's um, superb. Um, details are great and uh, some fantastic photographs yeah I, I still like books um, you know I think you can spend too much time online looking at rubbish but it's nice to have a book um, especially when you're reading in bed and stuff it's just relaxing I love it I always have since I've been young um, so yeah this is 1981 onwards obviously when um, Columbia um, had its first launch and orbit and re-entry and landing. Uh, this is um, superb. It's just one of the best books you can buy on the shuttle itself. It goes obviously starts off in the 50s and stuff when they had the um, X-15 uh, aircraft that went into space more or less lifting bodies and then it goes through how they designed it and made it and what its role was going to be um, there you can see it gliding what type of propulsion they were going to use um, in 1977 it did some um, piggyback flights on the back of a jumbo Specially designed uh, jumbo with stabilizers on the tail, um, and then it uh, glided back to the runway. Um, so it was supposed to launch in '79, but um, it didn't until April 1981. I remember seeing that in the TV when I was young. Uh, shows you how it was built, um, the kind of technology they had to use, um, the tiles, the um, ah, it's just fascinating. It's really, really good. It's a, it's a great book. Um, yeah, so you know, shuttle was pretty cutting edge technology back in the eighties and nineties. Um, you know, it was always on TV. There was always a mission. Um, and then in 1986, we had the um, Challenger disaster, which was very unfortunate. Um, it just highlighted some of the um, flaws in the system. The um, solid rocket boosters were not as um, safe and well made as they thought. Uh, yeah. And then, of course, uh, some of the key missions all through the decades and then there was the um, loss on re-entry in 2003 um, of uh, Columbia itself um, tiles broke off they never spotted it and uh, disintegrated into the atmosphere yeah so yeah it's a great book um and now shuttle is long gone it's after running its course and uh the us or nasa don't seem to have a replacement on the drawing board as of yet and uh, uh i remember seeing this on the front of time magazine i think um bruce mccandless it was the first um, untethered uh, spacewalk with a special type of propelled pack and it was hovering over the earth February 1984 um, yeah it, it, everything looks so modern yet it's 35 years ago 36 years ago uh, yeah it's incredible so yeah um, highly recommended um, the uh, NASA space shuttle Haynes manual
obviously these came from the uh, car workshop manual um, they come with all different types of subjects and they are superb value for money if you want to take your eyes away from a tablet or a smartphone this is where to go